My name's Matt Ferber and I'm a senior scientist at the GSK Human Performance Lab. The Rio 2016 Olympics will provide an extra environmental challenge to the athletes due to the hot and humid environment where conditions could reach 31 degrees Celsius and 70% humidity. These conditions can have a profound negative impact on endurance performance, not least through increases in core temperature and fluid loss. When winning margins can be so small, having an in-depth understanding of the athlete's physiological response to these conditions can be invaluable in supporting performance. Today we were looking at the differences that we'd expect between being in a hot environment, which might be a, in a worst case Rio scenario, and a much cooler environment doing a test on the bike. When it comes to the Olympic Games, you want to prepare as well as you can for the event. So you're preparing for any eventuality, and one of those is it could be really hot and humid. So that's what we've been working on here, to train for the hot conditions, but also how to prepare in terms of our nutrition and our hydration strategies in the lead up to the race. Being brothers does not mean you have the same physiological response. So it's important to take each athlete as an individual. Monitoring fluid balance through sweat rate and electrolyte losses, along with quantifying energy substrate utilization, we're able to understand the specific nutrition and hydration needs of each athlete. Using this information, we have developed personalized drinks, which include different amounts of carbohydrate and electrolytes. I always look forward to visiting the HPL. It's fantastic to be able to use these kind of facilities. It gives you that little bit of an edge. By looking at this level of detail, truly understanding individual response allows us to develop personalised strategies for the brothers. Coming to a place like this is about getting fine details right and learning new things helps us do that. You can really make big changes very, very quickly. 